Hi, I'm Mark Carosio from Gunmark TV, and I'm going to show you here one of the latest um, pneumatics from ATA, um, which are in Turkey, and it's um, quite an impressive. I must, to be perfectly honest, as an obsessive air gunner, I wasn't even familiar with ATA as a company, but uh, I appreciate they have quite a big name in shotguns and firearms. Um, but this, as one of their um, sort of early air guns, is very impressive indeed. And obviously, ignore the scope, but you're getting the air gun for £400, um, which uh, when you take it out of the box, I was a quite, in, you know, to say I was impressed is an understatement of the, the build quality and the sort of uh, engineering and finish. Very impressive indeed. This is the ATA Airborne. Um, it's obviously a walnut stock and it is actually a regulated action. I had to double check all that um, before I started but um, just to be to be sure on it all, of course, once I went over the chronograph, I knew it was a regulated action. But let's go on to the basics. So I've got a very nice walnut stock, um, laser cut checkering here. It actually picks out ATA, you can see in fine letters, but all very nicely done. Nice bit of figuring. There's a nice, precise feel to it. Really nice um, finish to it. Rubber butt pad. Um, moving through, you've got a two-stage trigger. Um, as I say, obviously more laser cut checkering on the front. You've got um, side lever action, Picatinny rails for the top, so you've got very firm and positive uh, scope mounting. Obviously, you've got to get appropriate mounts for that. Um, moving through, then you've got a very sizable buddy bottle and obviously that's for large shot count as you get with um, any of these buddy bottle systems. Um, then moving to the front, as you can see you've got a sort of matte finish to a lot of the sort of anodized finish to the to the block etc. Um, and then you've got a very nice matte finish to the barrel and um, silencer. The silencer is a, a simple screw fit onto the onto the threaded barrel and uh, that all, as I say, that the silencer comes with it. That's in the box, so you really are getting, you know, on the face of it, a lot of air gun for your money. Um, having now shot this, I can say that the performance is pretty impressive too, and we'll we'll come to that. So yeah, you've got the side lever action, and then as you open that up, you've got a mag your normal sort of rotary style cassette magazine. These are twelve shot, and. Uh, Let's, let's load up, the, I'll now show you to load up the magazine and then we'll see how it shoots. So with this uh, rifle they do obviously give you a manometer on the side there to keep a check on pressure. Um, you charge these to 220 bar um, which is uh, sort of yeah about average pressure. Then underneath I'll just show you where you charge it. It's uh, it's a conventional sort of Foster connector, but the, the it's quite a nice attention to detail. It's actually a um, machine threaded cap rather than just a push-on rubber plum, uh, plug that you often get with these things. So it's sort of above average for that. Right, going back to the magazine. Um, this is very similar to the um, sort of Theoban style, but. Um, like a lot of a few manufacturers they've sort of done it in reverse um, and that involves turning that original casing all the way around clockwise drop your first pellet in skirt first on the back that holds it all in place and thereafter you drop a pellet in in each chamber as it's exposed um, once you've done that you've got a nice a ridge on there slot in there pull back your lever and that just slides in so that all works rather nicely um, consistency wise on these obviously with this sizable buddy bottle um, you, you, you you know inevitably that's the whole sort of um, raison d'etre for these sort of style of rifles so you're getting a large shot count over the chronograph with this one uh, I got 300 shots this is in 2.2 calibre 300 shots all within around 20 feet per second which is superb consistency um, and pretty impressive uh, accuracy wise I've had sort of 5 8 inch groups of 40 yards um, and sort of ragged clusters of 25 so it, you know, you're talking very competent performance so it's an awful lot of air gun um, for 400 quid that's the ATA Airborne